Hello everybody and welcome back to the return of Peglin. We are jumping in again. This time we are going no Crucible because honestly we have been having a sucky time in Crucible and I, I think I just need to generally get better at the game again first because Crucible is really kicking my ass. I mean people have been giving me tips and I thank you all for those tips. Like um, one specific one I remember is that the Swash... Swash Buckle Orb, I think it was, is really good early on, and I've been skipping on it because I didn't think it was that good. So thank you muchly for that information, because that is, yeah, that is pretty key. Uh, we'll definitely go speed mode. Feels weird playing in regular speed now. It feels like it's going in slow motion. I'm that used to the uh, the speed up. But we're trying to get as much money as we can here, seeing if we can hit those bombs down below. We'll, we'll see what we do, what, what happens. But yeah, having less refreshes and stuff, it's been rough. And then of course we've been having trouble with the. Um, with the other flaws, having the shield guys and just never having piercing when we need it. It's been a real rough time, to be honest, but it's all pass and pass off of the game. It's just kind of how it goes. There's a bomb already. Won't kill. Actually, I was going to say it won't kill everything. Apparently, it will. Um, nice. Uh, okay, so this one exactly. This is the one right here. Um, collected from contribute additional one damage times damage to the target. So apparently they, they fall off late game, but apparently early game, these things are the tits. So um I'm gonna I'm gonna listen to you guys and take exactly that. Looking forward to playing more Peglin, honestly. I absolutely love this game. I really want to do a playthrough of Peggle at some point, maybe on the second channel. Um I think that'd be a lot of fun. And this game is of course a good stepping stone to that. As it with it being a rogue like it fits the channel pretty perfectly. Um Always good. Okay, we have detonated way too many bombs here at this point. We kind of want to just go for as much money as we can possibly get. So yeah, uh, I still don't fully understand how the swashbuckle orb works. So collected from hit money coins, contribute an additional one times damage. Does it... I don't know. Does it mean that I deal more damage per coin I get? Or do I get more money? Or, I don't think I get more money. It looks like I get more damage, but I'm still a little confused. But maybe it's upgrading it. Ah, I see. Okay, it's upgrading it that makes it the tits. I see now. Don't you dare. Okay, the fire's fine. The fire's fine. I want to go for these two chests down here, because they look rather tasty. So, it's when it's upgraded that it really starts to pop off. I see. That's good to know, thank you. And also, it looks like it can uh, can target any enemy. Yeah, okay. That's really good for, like, boss fights and stuff. When it can target any enemy. Obviously, there's a limited amount of money on the board, but I'm I'm sure there's some, some synergistic benefits to this bad boy um, that can get pretty nutty. I'm hoping we get a bomb here, but we'll see. Oh, yeah, that is... I really should have um, targeted one of the higher HP enemies there, but fool on me, I guess. So far, this is going pretty well. Uh, I'm going to go for this other bomb down here if I can get it to. Ah, oh, you bastard. I didn't want to refresh there. I mean, it's fine. We'll get more damage out, but the bomb's going to be that much harder to hit now. I've got two of them primed. Neither of them hit, but there you go. Easy. Easy, my son. Okay, so we level this up to level three. Yeah, three times damage is pretty insane. And then I think we, we go back and we see if we want to buy anything new. Heal four when fired can only be used once per battle. It only heals four. I, I feel like that's something that, upon being upgraded, might be really good. So I'm going to take it. It doesn't seem all that amazing right now. Um, An additional refresh sounds really good. Another chest, thank you. And we'll go to... We've got double back-to-back -back shops, which is actually kind of useless for us right now. Um, we'll go for all also granting crits. Yeah, I actually think the shop right here is useless. We go for the, um, that and then the shop and hope we can get enough money to make that work. But we don't need that right now. So really, we don't want to be shooting the money as much as possible early on until we get our swashbuckle orb. It's also, obviously it's not like guaranteed that you can dodge hitting the money. That's, yeah, that's pretty incredible. That's pretty incredible. Obviously, with it only targeting a single enemy, it's a little bit tricky to, to, to super utilize, but god damn, I like that. Bomb here is awesome because everything's on the field, and I think we're just going to go for another bomb here. Although, we should probably go for more money if we can get it, so let's, let's try that. 
I don't want to lose too much health to going for the money, but... There's that four heal. Bomb's going to kill most things, not all. And then we go for a little bit of extra money here. Lovely. Lovely jubbly. Upgrade. Heal six. And then... We still can't afford anything decent from the shop, I don't think, so I'm not that bothered about it. I'm going to try and get some money here, but eh. Shop, whatever. We couldn't afford you. I'm stupid. I didn't really play into that very well. That was good. Now that was good. 100 damage there onto one of the beefier enemies. Let's go like this to get all the money. That's, yeah, that's, that's a really nice orb right there. Very consistently high damage, I think. Kind of hard to get that bomb by going around the roundabout there. Should have kind of noticed that. This heal will be good for us, so yeah. Does an okay bit of damage too, that's not bad. It's not a great amount, but it's an okay bit of damage. Hey, two bombs out. Everything but one dead, I think. Oh no, everything dead. Nice. And then every attack is a crit. Convert every eight pegs hit into a crit. Hmm... I think we just want to get this guy up. Increase max HP by two when fired. Oh, ho, ho, baby. That sounds good. And I think we go with a ball lightning as well. There's just a little bit of extra power. And then... I th it doesn't matter which one of these we go for, actually. So let's go for the one where we're get getting a bit of extra money. It's only a little bit, but hey her. And then here... Probably go with that. And then we'll go this way. Try and go for this elite over here. Well... Basically, we get an elite either way. Um, when you lose health, deal two times damage to all enemies. Um, every reload grants one. Uh, we don't, we're not going to be reloading that often, so let's take that, even though I don't really think that's very good. And we'll go for this. Hello, elite. What are you? Okay, this is a fairly fine elite. I'm going to get rid of my ball lightning here, because I don't think we need to be using it right now. In fact, I'm pretty much going to play it safe and try to dunk my ball down the hole until the big boy arrives. In fact, I think I might just waste this turn altogether. There we go. Now we can start using this and go for the bombs. Oh, I forgot to change my target again. Stupid. <laughs> I'm going to keep doing that. I always forget that you can change targets and it's, it's a problem. It is a problem for me. I, I constantly do it. I keep forgetting refreshes also give crits. I don't know why I got rid of my crit orb there. Okay. Um... Yeah, gotta pay, gotta pay more attention here. This should kill everyone small. A few more bombs detonated. That's good. Right, he's the only guy we can hit now, so... Can't be buggering this up. 64, not bad. Thunder Orb here. Once we get this bad boy upgraded, that'll be pretty good. Right now, it's just okay. Okay, now we just need to hit a bomb. Come on. Hit a single... There you go. Well, good. We didn't lose too much health there. And we'll go for the upgrade on this bad boy. Get it up to max. That's that's not too bad. Uh, Boulder contained two additionals. Yeah, two additional refreshes sounds pretty good. Um, didn't really act, uh, mean to fire there, but it, it has happened now. What money are we at at the minute? Really not good money. I need to save more money, don't I? Continue. I don't care about the tree. Go for the combat. Shops haven't been our shtick this, uh, this floor, but that's okay. Kind of failed on that one there. I was hoping it would ride down this and it just kind of didn't. But we got a kill out of it, so who cares? How did you kick, hit everything there apart from... Oh, doesn't matter. Combat server anyways. Um, I think we're just going to continue here. And we do have more boss. Remember to fucking target the mole. Holy shit, you idiot. Remember to target the fucking mole. Hey, got that bomb nice. 
Good bit of extra damage. Hitting a bit too much money here, to be honest. Honestly, that, that thing does not, not bad damage at all. Good, and it actually targets them all this time. That's a lot of damage right there. Damn it, I was hoping to get a bomb with that one. How are you not hitting a refresh? Come on! Hit a bomb or a refresh, please! It's okay, it's dead. It's dead, it's dead. Okay, that, that went a lot easier than before. Um, Dense and Overflow. We don't have any piercing, so I'm going to take that. Um, and then I'm going to max upgrade it as well. Because we need something with Overflow damage. Okay. You no longer obtain gold, but your current shot's total damage is dealt to the target. Hmm, interesting. That's a really interesting idea. I mean, I want to keep getting money, so I'm going to take the Kinetic Blast. But that's a really interesting one that we could play around with on another run, maybe. I'm sure there's a build that goes along well really nicely with that, actually. We don't need the refresh yet. Fortunately, we can take the crit, but crit's not all that much use um, when these guys have shields. Remember that it does end on a refresh, uh, the kinetic blast energy thing. It's not permanent. A few bombs there, lightning that guy. Good, good, good. Um, Poltergeist Orb is kind of a tricky one. I think I'm going to say no for now and c keep my money going. Maybe even remove a stone here. There you go. There's some stuff we could add, but I'm honestly pretty okay with what we have right now. Ooh, hello. Some really nice stuff here. Um, detonate in one hit. You'll full damage to enemies with resistances. We probably want the one directly below us. That's also pretty good. Now this is, this is going to be tricky. I really want to go left here. Like, really, really want to go left. But there isn't much chance of me having much choice in the matter, so... I think the kinetic blast thing is kind of screwing us there. Ah, it's whatever. We missed out on an elite. It is what it is. Um, Death through the flames. First battle healing's better. I did just realise that I skipped on throwing out my um, my healing orb because I had full health. But actually I should be using it because it gives me max health as well now. So that was a little bit stupid of me, wasn't it? Unfortunately the thunder orb is taking up all the money that we should be using for the uh, swashbuckle orb. But... It is what it is. Nice damage there. There's some bombs, lovely. Good damage, bit of healing. Not getting an insta kill here, but nearly. Now we're getting an insta-kill. Lovely. You keep doing you, Crit Orb. Still haven't got any crazy numbers this run, but I think that's fine for the most part. Um, Pretty happy with what I've got right now, to be honest. Take our chest, of course. Let's go with the extra AMR, I like that. And go for the Elite here.
We don't actually need to use the uh, thing to get pass-through damage because there's nothing behind this guy, but still. We're mainly looking to detonate as many of those bombs as we can. So there's quite a lot on the field here. Missed that bomb completely. We're doing okay though here. That's looking at crit, lovely. Actually, are we doing okay? He's like just over halfway towards us and he's not even half dead yet, so maybe we're not doing okay. I don't know how to feel about this guy. See what comes about. There should be a pretty chunky hit there. 300 damage. That's not bad at all. Can we get a guaranteed crit on this one? I think we can. There you go. Still not a lot of damage though. Not a lot of damage at all. Gotta remember that if we get a if we get a refresh though, it does stop our ball bouncing like bouncing around like a maniac. It's just because we have so many refreshes on the board at the minute though. Okay, he did unfortunately get two attacks in there, which apparently killed him? Okay, I was not expecting that. I'm still plus 15 damage, nice. I don't know why he died there. Oh, because the, the HP, he took 50 damage per time he hit me there, I see, I see. Actually took quite a hefty bit of damage for that. You fool. Come on! Not a single bomb detonated. You've got to be kidding me. Okay, this is kind of rough. Need a lot more of these bombs to be going off, really. We're taking a lot of damage here. So many bombs to the left that I just can't get to. There's like three in this block and I haven't touched the block once yet. You survived with one HP? Why? Holy fuck, we've taken a beat in here. Just, oh my god. I think it's the kinetic blast that's screwing me. I can't actually aim where I want to aim. Well, that was rough. Um, we're gonna have to heal again. I think I'm gonna take another one of these and then upgrade it again. Because we do have a boss and we have very low HP coming into this boss, which I'm very, very afraid of. One moment. One second, guys. Okay, we are good. Right, um, the overflow damage is actually pretty good here. See what we can get taken out. A lot of money on this one, so the swash orb would be good if we got it early, but unfortunately it's quite low down in the list. Oh, we've been confused. Did he hit me? What did he hit me with? Okay, there's all the bombs, lovely. I think I might die to this, this thing, you know. I think it's gonna be really hard for us to survive this. We're not dealing an awful lot of damage. I mean, it's a good amount, but like, if he hits me even a few more times, it's going to be problematic. And we've got very little bombs left to work with, so... Like, this, he's going to load it up now. Yep, there you go. Unfortunately, we got taken out there. Not great. We'll give it another go. I'm just not very good at this game. Like, all in all, I'm just not very good at this game. <laughs> I don't know how to build, like, put together a build that's actually good. Honestly, this this run, Skip Relic, this run is trash. I want a new Relic on start. That was, that was offensive to me. A new one, please. Those Relics were horrible. Um... Ooh, okay, we'll go with that. Try and get a lot more money during navigation, maybe. One second. Right, okay. Let's try this again. Oh, the game's in slow motion again. He actually got a bomb there off the bat, too. We've got a few more ready and primed. 
Wow, we did a lot there. That's another bomb. Good to go. Hey, that was a very good first turn. Um, Let's grab that. I kind of like that. It can be good. It's it's a little skew if sometimes. For the most part, it's good. I didn't check the navigation at all here, but I'm actually pretty happy with the way that I went, my god. Um... Okay, so yeah, we really want to be going for money during navigation as much as we can, because it's going to be worth so much more to us. We can probably garner quite a lot from it, really. I'm just going to go for the bombs here, honestly. They're going to be so valuable. We've primed a few and thrown one, so that's good. These trees, some guys can be a pain, though. Yeah, this, this thing that can press orbs multiple times, it's okay right now, but it gets a lot better later on. Really want to hit that bomb so this guy can get past. Oh, actually, that's just fine. You got past him pretty easily there. No need to deal 34 damage. There you go, we did it. Not bad at all. We could also go with an Orbalisk here, which is uh, buffed up for every stone that we have, um, which is kind of interesting. But I think right now I'm more interested in getting this bad boy upgraded. And then navigation, we want to be going over there. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Not having that. And I've started with fucking Crucible on. Eh! I'm getting fucking stressed out with this game, my, my, my guys. I'm getting stressed out. This game's annoying the fuck out of me. Be easier. God damn, why are you so difficult? Means to damage when reloading. That's very good. God damn, this game is tricky. I, I swear that... Like, I don't know if it's just because they've, like, updated and added a lot more to the game, but I swear it used to be really easy to get a win. Like, if you go back and look at my initial episodes in the series, I kind of slap at this game and was getting wins, like, every episode, and now I just can't do it. And I don't know what it is, but god damn, it's so tricky. I think the game's just more complicated now, with all the, the, the shops and everything. There's so much more to think about. But yeah, unfortunately, I suck at it. Um, weak damage that cannot be modified. Weak crit damage, sorry, that cannot be modified. That's kind of an interesting one, because we want less crits on the board. I don't really want that. We'll go with the, the, the Warhammer orb thingy for the dense overflow or whatever. I don't really care which way I go here. I really should go for more navigation money, but as we just proved in that last battle, it just isn't worth it. I want it to go all the way over here. And of course, you give me the fucking lollipop. Ugh. Right, I want to go left. How the hell do I make it go left? There must be like a specific place you can shoot to like guide it where you want it to go. But for me, it's just, I don't know. It's obviously made to be somewhat random. It's like a plinko machine, but ugh. Could you just not be for once? Luckily, we've got these wooden boys, which aren't too bad for us. We have a shop coming up shortly as well, so we should try and collect as much money as we can here. Oh, just hit the bombs. Please, just hit the bombs. They're so easily hittable. Thank you. Fortunately, that guy got very close. We ain't going to be doing much to this second guy. Not yet, at least. But yeah, I'm feeling like at the minute I kind of need to have a good a good relic on start to, to have a good time because I'm really getting shit on. Which isn't great. <sighs> a testament to the very low skill that I have in this game. This guy's dead though, that's good. Good, good. Apply blind. Never really thought the blind was that good. Let's take the spear. Upgrade the spear first. Go for the chest. Lovely. I wanted to get that elite, but hey her. Um, whenever an enemy is defeated, refresh the board. Um, deal extra damage. Let's, let's try that. We've got a question mark here as well. Right. 
Remove all orbs. It's been a while, so I'm going to go for it. Just look at that. Why? Just go that way. Fuck you. <laughs> I mean, I can still get to the shop, but come on now. It's... Why do you do this to me? So this is a very interesting orb for those of you that haven't seen it. Basically, we can use it multiple times. Um, but it... Uh, persists its damage through to the next turn, essentially. So we get to keep the damage from the last turn onto the next turn, and we can stack it up in some pretty interesting ways. Trying to get to those sweet, sweet bombs, but the game is not in favor of that idea whatsoever right now. Haha! -ha, all of you miss. Okay, there's a few bombs popped. Okay, everything's dead. I was going to go to the shop, but now I don't really care. I'll be honest. Just get me some more money. If I end up going to the shop, that's fine. Just give me as much money as you can give me. Up to seven. Continue on my way. And we'll take the chest as well. Let's go with that, shall we? And then Elite. Orob the Ouroboros Orb. We'll see how it goes. Orb Roboros? Orb Roboros? Orb Roboros? I can't remember what it is. Should be pretty good for this. Hey, the bomb's good. Being able to activate multiple crits in one turn, too. Oh, we, we killed one enemy in a single turn. That's beautiful. And then, yeah, we keep some of that damage over to the next turn, so... Likewise, this guy is also dead. Trying to go for the money here. That was... That was incredible. Um... I am going to take a bold orb as well, because that does give us piercing. Um, two additional crits, that's fantastic, yes. And then here, let's just go for some more money, I guess. I don't really care if I take a bit of extra damage. There you go. I didn't really check which way we'd be going here, but it doesn't matter. We can go for a chest, actually, if we keep going this way. Duplicate a random orb, I guess. Please say it duplicated the right one. Yes, it did! Huzzah! Two Ouroboros orbs. Right, this time, shoot over here to get over here. That worked. See, that was, that, that was more smart of me. I'm more smarter than I thought I were. Probably should have gone for the crits there, but oh well. Good thing about the stacking crits is the Ouroboros will uh, obviously follow through. And that will follow on to our next orb. We start with really high base damage, and it keeps going to 285. This is going to be good. But this guy, he's a little weakling orb. Doesn't do much damage at all. How did you not hit that other crit? Come on now, game. It's okay, though. Our damage is stacked right now. It's going to keep staying stacked. Honestly, this is a robber or orb robber or whatever setup is pretty darn good for us. Take another chest, lovely. I like that muchly. On to the boss. Um I think we should go for the extra crit damage. See where this takes us. Okay, tree or mighty tree. Wait, one of them's level three now? Did I did I just do that? Okay, I thought it was I th I thought the one that I duplicated was level one for some reason. I upgraded to level two. I understand what's happening now. I'm j I'm just a bit stupid. The only problem with this is we don't have much opportunity to hit this guy because we only have one method of piercing. So this guy is going to be able to get away with a good amount. Reeling to stack up as much damage as possible for future turns. Honestly, though, 272 in one hit is pretty darn good.
Nice, two a nine. On to a two eight. Yeah, okay. That was that was actually incredibly easy. Okay, and then we upgrade you. And then we upgrade you. Now. I think we go for durable, because that means we can hit crits more than once, right? I think that's the play here. Pegs being durable can be problematic, because it means that you can't get to refreshes easily and stuff, but I think this is the way to go. I should be able to hit crits multiple times now. Which should be really insane for us. So far, that's looking to be true. Unfortunately, the shield is going to eat all of this damage. So it's not exactly super lucrative to get this much damage going. Unless the shield gets it, of course. But now when we fire our next one, it's going to already have insane damage on, on like, launching it. 960-something. Yeah, Can we get a refresh, please? That'd be ace. Where those refreshes at? There's one. Obviously, we do lose some of that damage each time we fire, but still. Ain't nobody uh, sad about 900 damage. Now we just need something that can give us constant overflow damage. Then we're really in the money. Oh, come on. The shield has five health and I did a fucking... 1,900 and something damage to it. It's just stupid or how much damage I did. But it's just... It ate the entire fucking damage. It should overflow through the shield. It's dumb. Okay, this, this, this is good shit. This build's got some legs. Oh, for God's sake. I didn't even look at the navigation again. Oh, for f Probably should have gone that way. Oh, well. It's happened now. Ooh. No, no, no. Skip. I've, I've seen that before. It can be disastrous. Let's not take that. It can be really good, but it can also be pretty disastrous. Okay, that one was not very good. But we got a kill out of it, so it's fine. We've only got 120 health pair, actually, these guys, so it should be relatively easily. Easily? Relatively easy. Be interesting if you could get multiple sets of money from them, but that's not going to happen. Look at that. <laughs> you can hit a crit three times and just get insane bonuses. Like I said, we just need something to make this do overflow damage, then we're in the money. We cannot upgrade. Oh, that's an interesting noise. Might as well just heal. Um, let's go for the two question marks, if we can get to them. Yes? Yeah, that's pretty good, that's pretty good. I've had this before. This is a pretty interesting build now. I mean, it always was, but... Yeah, every five pegs hit, we deal that one damage, but also steal one HP. But because of the way that the, the pegs being durable works, we're going to be able to hit the, the pegs a lot. We've also built up an insane amount of damage here. Like I said, we just need overflow. Yeah, durable pegs and the healing one go really well together. It's fine and dandy. 4,000 damage. Oh, we've, made, we've reached 12,000. 14,000, 15,000. Just imagine how much we would have healed here as well. And then the next orb fired does 7,900 damage just from being fired. 
It's gonna be a while before this thing falls, I think. Boom. Quite, quite the overkill that we've got going here. Oh. Thank you. Onto the shop. Removing an orb doesn't do much for us, so it's basically about these. Um, ooh, that's potentially pretty good because we reload somewhat often. Yeah, let's go with that. Some of the layouts like this aren't quite as good for it. Oh, these guys have shields again. Fuck off with your shields. Also, we can discard these for 5 HP cost, which sounds bad, but it's actually fine because um, we can get that health back so quickly. Oh, I was really hoping for a bunch of crits there to just take all these guys out, but still, that's good damage. Get rid of all their shields. Yeah, we've got to remember discarding is actually pretty damn good for us. I don't even know if it's worth having two Ouroboroses. It, we, we, might be, we might just want to get rid of one of them if we can. Doesn't seem like there's much point, to be honest. And stretch the chest, I think. If the game can allow us. with that. Definitely want to go this way. Get that extra chest going. Really want to hit crits here if we can, but probably not going to be super likely. Oh, actually, there's some there. Yeah, we got one. There you go. Perfect. You, the rest of these enemies don't have shields, so we can pretty much play these guys normally. Right, and then this is just going to be a mess. I'm just going to have to let this ride and hope it falls. Yep, there you go. Didn't take as long as I thought it would. No, that's going to put us somewhere else that I don't want to be. I want my chest. One additional crit sounds very good to me. And we got Wall Boy, which this guy should be a piece of piss. Honestly. Unfortunately, all the crits are right near the bottom. In fact, this guy's going to be so fucking easy. Holy shit. If we can get, like, land on a crit... It's over. Yeah, this guy's fucked. <laughs> He's already almost dead. Wow. You are fucked, my boy. Absolutely fucked. How much damage is my Arborobros doing? Okay, that's pretty good. Plus four to crit. Oh, that's actually that's really good. That we'll go with that. We're not gonna take any damage away from us. A little more controllable than the Makushka doll orb thing. One less refresh is annoying, but mostly fine because we don't need refreshes anywhere near as often anymore. I mean, like, these two are already dead, look. Easy combat. Not bad at all. 
Not bad at all. Got a shop right off the bat as well here. Lovely. Check behind the waterfall. Oh, ho, 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 ho. that goes really well with this because now we're dealing two damage every few orbs hit. Right. I don't know exactly how to get this where I want it to be, but that should work. Straight into the shop. So do we remove one of these? I think we do. I, I don't think we need to. I don't think it makes sense. Get our additional refresh back. I like that. Good, good. I'm, I might have been wrong in doing that. Some people might know better than I, but personally, I don't see why we should, should have two Ouroboroses when we want to be getting to our, um, our Bulldog quicker. Because there's going to be situations where we want that more. I could duplicate the bold orb. I'm going to do that. Going all the way down the question mark path here to that, to that elite. Enter the tear. Oh, that was, that was dog shit. That was so bad. Deals three damage to me immediately all of it's healed up. And we're dealing so much damage just off of hitting pegs, it's kind of insane. He's dead. Each shot a random slot portal could be opened. Ooh, that's really good. Um How many crits do we have on the board right now? Um plus two. That's pretty good. Let's take that. I have to do this. I don't know what the fuck orb I just picked up, but I'm not going to be happy about it, am I? Transforms into a random earned orb each reload. Okay, that's fine. Let's see if we can manage to get to the elite here, but we'll see what happens. Hey, nice one. Got rid of the two real threats, and then we got this guy. And you're basically dead already, my good sir. Not quite, but very close to. In fact, there you go, you're dead. Easy stuff. Make for bomb damage, why not? I would like to go to the left one, but honestly, yeah, okay, that actually worked fine. I thought it was going to be really hard to make happen there, but it's fine. Whenever you heal lost health, deal three times. Oh my goodness. This is quite the business we're going to be putting on enemies. Just by hitting, um, hitting enemies, we'll be doing so much. Oh god. I forget, I always forget this level exists. All the pegs are invisible. But like, look how much damage we're going to be doing, just based off of, um, just based off of actually hitting pegs. We've already dealt, like, over a hundred. Oh shit, I forgot this was the stage that has, um, thingy. A bunch of invisible enemies in front. I mean, they're still going to die very quickly, but it'd be nice if we could just hit him. But we're dealing damage directly to him, so. The stage looks so much more funny with uh, the money. Before, the money wasn't a thing, so you didn't see all these invisible floating bits of money. It's quite funny. Hmm. 
Yeah, you see how we've almost killed this guy without even actually hitting him once? It's ludicrous how good this is. Would be interested to try to kill him with just this, actually. But I think 4,000 damage is going to do it. Or oh, however much we're going to end up getting to here. 10,000. It just keeps going. It just keeps going. Holy shit. There you go. <laughs> and that's that. That's good stuff. Right down we go, I think. Okay, this one we're not getting a one-hit kill. Oh no, we are. Doesn't matter. I lied. Slightly hard to get this one exactly where we want it, but... Worked out. I'm gonna get to go straight for a chest here as well. Lovely. Ah, I went the wrong way for the crits. We still got them there. Not quite the full 700, but very close to. And there you go. Oh, there's one more guy left. I didn't even see that. The whole stationary copy thing is gonna be ludicrous. Gonna be so good. Any shops before we leave? No, unfortunately not. Yeah, plus one discards. Ooh, that's really good actually. We'll take that. That's that that's useful just in case we need to get to our bold orb. Our bold orb's probably more useful than anything else right now. Attempt to dodge. I'm gonna do that. Someone said that I'm I was shooting in the wrong place. Apparently I want to be shooting down here, I think. Didn't work with this orb, but I'll believe you. I'm not sure exactly where it was. I think it was there that people said. Wait for this one, I think it is. Oh, this is really... Where am I meant to be shooting this? Because I'm not getting this right at all. I'm going to die if I don't get it right. Okay, that was really good. I didn't kill anyone? Okay, one of them is almost dead, though. Oh, damn, we are taking hefty damage now, though. I was expecting each shot to get us to full health, and it's unfortunately not, actually. This one's going to, though, I think. Yeah, this one did. A lot of bombs. Kill on you. We should be okay now, I think. Okay, that's where it works. It's just with the weight of the bold orb, it doesn't work, really, does it? Ah, uh, we might die here. We might die here. No, not quite, not quite. We should just about live through this. There's so many crits, I need you to hit way more than what you're hitting currently. But I think we've got the win here. There you go, that was a tricky one. We almost lost that with our low max HP there, but that was a lot of fun. I hope you guys enjoyed that one. We finally got a win. And yeah, um, I will see you guys in the next one.